Carl here. How you guys doing? Welcome back to my channel, man. Today, we're going to go ahead and get started with a new series for you guys, Java Programming. And in today's video, we're going to show you guys how to install Java, as well as if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, make sure you hit that thumbs up. It helps the algorithm a lot. And please feel free to leave a comment on what kind of tutorials you guys would like to see. If you haven't checked out already, I have a sequel series that you guys can check out. The card is showing right now. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into some Java. To go ahead and get everything kicked off, you're gonna to need to download two things. You're gonna to need to download Java Development Kit 18. And you can do that by simply going to the Java downloads or just typing in your Google search, go to Java downloads and make sure that you're downloading the Java SE development kit 18. And if you're doing it on a Linux, Mac or Windows, it doesn't make a difference. You can download all the different versions or whatever suits you. The next thing you're going to have to download, is you're going to have to download a, an IDE and this IDE for Java developers, uh, it's very common it's called eclipse it's free and all you have to do is do your google search again type in eclipse ide for java developers once you get to the landing page you're gonna like a just like downloading the java you're gonna select either windows mac or linux once you have those two things downloaded then we can get into the cool stuff once you have your eclipse downloaded go ahead and open it now i would add that if you're a windows user when you download eclipse you're going to have to extract all the files in order to use the IDE. But once you do that, you just go ahead and open up Eclipse Workspace. Once you get it open, you want to go to File. You want to go to New. And then you want to go to Class. And once you get to Class, you want to you see that it's going to give you a folder called Hello. Then you're going to make sure that on this part right here, it says which method stubs would you like to create. Just call it Public Static because you want everything to open up here and then just give it a name and just keep in mind that that name cannot have any spaces in it so we're just going to call this my tutorial let's get that lowercase once you get that downloaded you can go ahead and expand your window expand mine. but then you'll get a window here and then you get a lot of space here in this space the console space is the most important space that we're going to be utilizing the next thing i want you to do is go ahead and delete this message right here you really don't need it right now and i'll get into this a little bit more in the other tutorials so just delete that message now that you've gotten that deleted i want you to go ahead and start typing system and just be aware that it's very you have to get the uppercase and lowercase right so make sure that the s is uppercase and the rest of it is lowercase so print line and then we're going to say our hello world right here and i'm just going to say how you doing how you doing and just don't forget to close it off at the end semicolon and then we can go ahead and hit run and if you you'll see it at the bottom how you doing how you doing just run that again bam and that's how you do that now if you've gotten this far i'm pretty sure you did a lot of work and we're going to continue this series just basically explaining what public class plug public static void and all of these things mean but for now we're going to go ahead and end the tutorial right here so go ahead and pat yourself on the back because you did a good job if you made it this far and you got your thing to say hello world or how you doing whatever one you chose now we are one step closer to learning java to knowing java and to get started writing javascripts i hope you guys enjoyed that quick tutorial make sure you smash that thumbs up make sure you subscribe and make sure you share this video so somebody can take this journey with you my name is carl and we're going to continue to learn on and grow as we grow we'll see you guys in the next one peace